Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon White Version. Today I got a special guest with me. Silent Registeel, the host with the most. <laughs> In today's episode, we're going to go and go into Pinwheel Forest, because we can, and stop Team Plasma. I didn't see mention this in the last episode, but if you go up here, there's a hidden item up here. It's a super potion. And actually, this item that I got earlier was a, the dowsing machine. It's actually pretty handy, so I'm going to be using it a lot in this episode. And, oh, Super no. potions are pretty super. Yeah, the potions are pretty super. And as you can probably exactly. tell, it's pretty late when we're recording this, so Josh is pretty out of it. I don't want to hear it, Matt. <laughs> there are only two ways out of your Kerma Forest. There's the path straight through, and there's the path through the forest. If we head down, yes. we should catch up to them. Even if they're not there, we'll make sure to shut up the exits so they can't escape. Would you yeah. search the route to see if there's any plasma grunts hiding? There are a lot of trainers no. too, but it's a straight path in essence. So you won't get lost. Well then, shall we do this for Miss Alo? You know what's kind of funny? The fact that it said that uh, the gym leader... Um, what's her name? Gosh, I can't even remember her name anymore. Lenora, that's it. Which one? Lenora. Oh, yeah. They, they, they say that she's married, and, well, uh, <laughs> the funny thing is, though, um, Artie just said Miss Alo, like, M-I-S-S Alo, and she's married. Isn't that a typo of some sort? You know what I mean? Probably. Yeah. Anyways, we're taking down these Just Skype chat. You're just Skype chat. <laughs> Anyways. More plasma! Yeah! Dumber. We get to hear the awesome music. <laughs> I'll show you what it meant, what right it would keep me off of the racks. Gosh, I just messed that up. What are you doing, Josh? What? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> what are you doing? I meet my mic because Eric yelled something down to me. Eric, why are you? He's upstairs. He can't hear you. Why are you yell? Oh yeah, this is the battle that pissed me off a lot. Yeah. One, the sand dial did torment, and two, here in a second, you see, I, I was like, oh crap, I forgot to keep the same move twice. And he starts this crap with a sand attack. Josh, are you? Dude? Right. Are you all right? What? Are you okay? Why are you say? Because you're like out of it. <laughs> I don't want to hear it, Matt. <laughs> I'm just glad we're actually able to record. Yeah, I just don't want you falling asleep on me like you did with your. <laughs> just yell. I'll wake up. But he's terrible. Josh, wake up! <laughs> hey, yeah, I need. It's, to it's weird when it lags. He's starting this crap with the freaking sand attack. It's starting to piss me off. I mean, in case you guys didn't know, sand attack lowers your accuracy. It makes it harder for your moves to hit the Pokemon. And he keeps using it. didn't know that, I don't know how. That's the most basic thing you could ever know about Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, that'd be pretty sad if you didn't know about sand attack. Too bad, I don't have a thing. If you want it, <laughs> want it back, bad. You better go find the rest of us. I don't have a thing on like. <laughs> oh gosh. Anyways, we got another team plasma coming blocking our way. Oh, looking for something, are we? Yes. Yeah, the awesome music. Where is it? Looking for your girl plasma. Okay. <laughs> that was. Ah. <laughs> uh, A Team Plasma Grunt, to Madre is the look of Punta. Why is Silent Registeel speaking Spanish? Because I know how. Do a lot better than I can. 
Oh yeah, that's right. This stupid Wormoid starting to crap with the sand attack too. Why is everybody using sand attack? Oh my gosh, I just realized. We're, I don't even know why, but I forgot about the fact we were recording. I started to check some other website. Are you serious? <laughs> don't watch. We're recording. Why are you doing this? I forgot. <laughs> I didn't think it was possible, but I forgot. <laughs> I forgot that we were recording. Oh my gosh, stupid sand attack. Die. Die, Merloin. Yay. Just got hit in the butthole. It's HD Elder wants to learn the boo Bruce. So want to be deleted, yes. Theoretically, here. And what, Ru what Bruce does, it, it, it's kind of like cover for a bird type Pokemon. Makes you, it heals HP. That's not, that's not the other thing it does. What does it do? It also gets rid of your flying type of, for that turn. Wait, what? If you use Roost, yeah, I'm, I, I am awake enough to think about this. If you use Roost and your guy is flying, it gets rid of your flying type for the turn. Oh, uh, really? So you can actually hit it with ground type moves? Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, I didn't know that. Anyways, I'm gonna try to get these items thrown here quick, so... REPEL TIME! Yes, jump yeah. or repel. You only bought two, man. No, actually, those are the repels I found. <laughs> actually, so you didn't even buy them. No. I am disappointed, good sir. <laughs> Anyways, that was the big root. What the big root does is it... it what does the big root do? It's like, uh... If you hold it, it... All like recover type moves. Recover yeah, moves. moves like drain punch. It'll still do the same amount of damage, but you recover more than what you normally would. Okay. Anyway, we're gonna. How, how am I awake enough to think about these things? But the second we talk about literally anything else, my brain is going Yeah, but uh, the second we talk about Pokemon, I'm like, yeah, I know this. And we talk about, like, this dialogue in the game, and I'm like, whoa. Anyways, yes, guys, I did, in fact, download the entire original soundtrack of Pokemon Black and White, so I could head music to the f fast up versions of the battles. Anyways, this guy gets... You should have put him on every day. Of course, alive, every day. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, whatever you say, sir. Okay, let's put Wecker up front, because Puppy leveled up. You called it Puppy. Well, that's what his name is. That's what I named him because he was a cute little lily pup, man. He called it puppy. It's like the most generic pet ever. I'm sorry, I'm unoriginal. I'm very what? unoriginal. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> my Pokemon are awesome. Battle and you'll know why. Oh my gosh, you remind me so much of that that Joey guy from Gold and Silver. <laughs> Hey man, my rats are so cool, man. Okay, bye. And then you get shot because he just gave away your position. <laughs> and if you guys aren't knowing what we're talking about, there's like a funny Pokemon comic based on gold and silver. Like, if any of you guys remember the Golden Rod Radio Tower when Team Rocket took over, the main the comic is the main hero was was trying to sneak up on the rocket, and as soon as he was trying to sneak up on him. <laughs> The, the trainer calls the cell phone and tells you about how cool your rat is and he hangs up and then the next frame is uh, the the trainer being choked out by a rocket. <laughs> I just realized that the advertisement on Skype says peace one day is calling the global truce. What? I don't know. <laughs> I found an antidote. Like I'll ever need that right now. Actually, if I... What? Troll. Dude, he just trolled you. Just trolled he's, me. He's pooping all over you. <laughs> he freaking... She freaking jumped out of nowhere. I is think he it's, she? Yes, it's actually a she. Are you a boy? <laughs> I've been your neighbor for many, many years. Are you a boy or a girl? That's about Professor Oak. Actually, guys, at the end of the episode, I'm going to show you a funny picture my friend Lester made. Of that She's just going to put a picture at the end of the episode. Yeah. It's actually pretty funny because it's it's about my issue with the shiny lily puff back Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, gosh. I'm never going to live that down.
I've already had to live it down, man. I even have the date recorded on a piece of paper on my EB training sheet. Over there, I could get it, but... <laughs> requires effort. Anyways, what happened, Josh? Tell, tell us the story. Oh my god. I was, um, trying to clone some Master Balls doing the whole Emerald thing. Just because I was always worried about the whole shiny deal. Wait, one second. Troll! Wait, sorry, what? My dad walked in. What? Okay, let's oh, that's... breathe. Ha! Breathe. Ha! Okay, now let's battle our Pokemon. Gosh. Anyways, back to what your story was about the shiny. What was, what was I even about to say? Because my dad walked in asking for the phone, so I muted my microphone real quick. Yeah, anyways. What was the story about your, po your uh, shiny Pokemon incident? Yes, I was trying to clone the Master Balls in case I run into any shiny Pokemon. That way I don't ever have to worry about that. For whatever reason, my mind at that point was like, man, I gotta go to get this. Um, because I kept on forgetting to do it. If you go into the abandoned ship area, which I'll probably show on my Let's Play, you can get the... And there's like a thing you can get to get the um, Deep Sea Tooth or Deep Sea Scale, and on my way there, I met the Shiny Tentacle, and I was like, holy F, I have no Pokeballs. F my life. <laughs> <laughs> and didn't you say you had... Uh first Pokemon you ever run into in the Emerald version, which is a Poochyena. Didn't you say that Pokemon is, was a shiny Poochyena? That was on Sapphire, but yeah. That sucks. <laughs> and then after, the next one after that was the one in Emerald, where it was just a normal shiny golf bat, and I was able to catch that one. I was like, oh yeah, caught that. Caught a shiny. And after that, I got the, what was it, shiny Registeel, which I thought was pretty ballin'. I caught <laughs> that one. That was in, yeah, that was in Platinum. And I got Shiny Magic Card and Soul Silver, which that was really easy. I called it Goldfish. That was pretty beast. <laughs> was it actually? Yeah, it's Gold Magic Card. Yeah. I think I said never really saw a Gold no. Magic Card before. Or the Shiny. I think I'm missing one. Yeah, and on the original Silver, I got oh, another Shiny Gold. And at that point, I was like, man. Not only have I met a shiny, but I've met two of the same shinies, and I've caught both. <laughs> wow, that is ridiculous. That's right, I was just here to stall you. Yeah, what better hurry that? up, or those grunts will get away. Quit he literally just trolled you. He just literally trolled me. <laughs> uh, like he's got that troll smirk. <laughs> he's got the troll face. Just like uh, Jared gives like the best troll faces. I don't even know why, but he does. <laughs> that guy just trolled me too because he just jumped out of nowhere. Oh wait, this yeah. is the guy. <laughs> Hold on, just. Oh gosh, I wish I didn't spin speed this up. Oh my gosh, he says something pretty nasty at the end of the battle. <laughs> <laughs> I remember this. I remember you. Let me see if I can. Let me see if I can. See what it says. Okay, he says. Do you feel my wilderness? <laughs> he said, do you feel my wilderness? That is pretty nasty. <laughs> oh, gosh. Okay, that would have been a lot of fun here if you weren't lagging so effing badly on my side. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Josh. I know, it just sounded like, yeah, I, uh, wilderness. <laughs> <laughs> well, let me just rephrase it so Josh can hear me. I said, the guy said... <laughs> he asked me, can you feel my wilderness? And I was like, oh yeah. <laughs> Anyways, here's the plasma we're fighting, trying to chase down. Whoa, what's this? My allies could, couldn't have been defeated by this dwarf, could they? Uh, well, whatever. I'm your opponent. And now we have to fight another team, plasma drive. But the music's pretty epic. Actually, like it's I said before, that this this version has a lot of good uh, original soundtracks. Some um, it's not my favorite, but it's definitely yeah. up there. What is your favorite? My favorite. I don't know. Uh, and, oh yeah, my favorite of all the soundtracks would have to be Lance and Red theme on Gold and Silver. There's a pretty nice tune. Yeah, I mean, my gosh, it still got it stuck in my head all the time. When I'm thinking of, like, 
epic gym late our champion battles. Yeah, that's the one that comes up. You know what's funny? I was talking. Music. Go ahead. Uh, for all the music, mine would have to be the Pokemon Coliseum main menu thing. <laughs> I was talking to Lester the other day, and, like, he was training for... He was, uh, grinding for the Elite Four and Yellow version. And he's like, I got that stupid Victory Road theme stuck in my head, and I said, Dude, I still have the Victory Road theme stuck in my head with Park Gold and Soul Silver, because I grind there all the freaking time. It's kind of like how I have, just because I've played through Sapphire and Emerald so many times, I have the entire victory. Actually, I pretty much have the entire map memorized of everything. I could show you every he hidden item, I could show you everything about that game. <laughs> anyway, we got the Dragon Skull back. Could this mean our Dragon hopes Knight. and our King's hopes were all in vain? And yes. we, got, we got Epic Troll coming. <laughs> troll smirk. <laughs> Are you alright? You swore your loyalty to the king. <laughs> Sage! I got the skull <laughs> this far, but then it was stolen right before my eyes. No, actually, you just gave it to him. <laughs> it was just give up on the dragon skull for now. After all, it's nothing to do with the legendary Pokemon that Team Plasma has been searching for. But we will not overlook your meddling. Don't get in our way again, or we'll make you pay. We will. What? You have no- Backup's coming in, look at that. Ah, mm. great. The bustling of the bug Pokemon, I could tell a big shot was around. Did you come to aid the guys we just need? <laughs> exactly. Oh, more reinforcements. Matt! Artie! The others didn't have chance. So, what is this guy? What is this guy there, boss? I am one of Team Plasma's seven sages. Gitas, also one of the sages, is using his elegance to convince people to release their Pokemon. The rest of us sages are exactly. the members of Team Plasma to steal Pokemon. But this is the only. <laughs> <laughs> the bug user already, and the normal user alone. I know that you two would fight a hundred battles. We will obediently pull back for now. We shall take Pokemon from trainers to liberate them! Not even f from gym leaders shall we lose to meddling. Then what will this matter be resolved? Regardless, I look forward to it. And he disappears like a pansy. No, he's just too good for you. He did David Blaine. <laughs> You wanna give chase? <laughs> no. We cornered them and took back your stolen skull. Who knows what else were they guilty of? Well, Miss Alo, I've gotta get going. And also, I'll be waiting for you <laughs> to challenge me at the Gillian Pokemon Gym. <laughs> Emphasis on you. <laughs> yep, yep. Oh really, looking forward to that battle. Yes, you will. You know, I thought it was kinda of funny how this wrong. Out of all the cities, Castilia's name is still Castilia, and that's wrong. Castilia's too good for you. <laughs> the trainer kind and sure and fine, making way Pokemon around happy. Oh my gosh, I butchered that. This is a token of my thanks. Treasure it. And we got a Moonstone. Yay! <laughs> you know, I'm gonna look up right now if you should use that right away or not. Yeah. Because right I can, now. I can use this to uh, evolve Muna into Musharna right now if I really want to, and Josh is gonna do research for me. Shut up! I'm doing research. <laughs> Shut up! I'm doing research, man. I'm getting there. Anyways, before I end this episode, there's a couple items I need to pick up here. The first being this miracle seed. Yes, we got a second miracle seed. Don't know why you would need a second one, but. All right. And the last item's over here, you guys can see it right there. I'm gonna cut out all the freaking Pokemon battles, and... <laughs> I'd wait until about level 37 to evolve it. Okay. Because if you evolve it, it won't learn any more moves at all. Okay. Uh, I actually probably won't have Moon around that long, so... Well... <laughs> yeah, I'll probably, like... Just, just sit on it. Could do. At the end of this LP, I should, like, trade all the Pokemon that I've used. It's like an epic team, like team box or something. 
Then you can fight me. Yes. Like my epic <laughs> yeah, I just flipped over the roof. Wade's level 22. And I'm gonna grab this item and then we're gonna call it an episode. No. Yeah. Okay. Anyways, we got this TM. It's TM86 Grass Knot. Anyways. Kill Swamp. <laughs> this has been Matt. And. The host with the most. <laughs> we'll see you guys next time.